An awesome purse giveaway, the perfect fall date night and bacon cocktails. Oh, it's a good day, stay line. Hello and welcome to a good day, state line. Happy Friday. We love Friday so much on GDS because we get to make cocktails at the end of the show. Tonight, bacon cocktails with Mike Peck from the Ice Hogs. Plus, how about closing out a fall travel week with a mini trip over to Prairie Fire in Byron. We have a great show for you tonight. Before we get to that, we have to name this week's Fan of the Week. Our question was, what's your favorite motivational quote? Our winner this week is Kyle. He said, complaining is a zero return investment. Okay, he won a GDS swag bag packed with goodies. We'll give you a new Fan of the Week question on Monday night, but now it's time for Insta Chat. Every night, breaking down the latest trending Hollywood stories here and inside our Instagram story. Do you remember the show, Joe Millionaire. We're taking you back to 2003 on this one, a very Bachelor-esque show, but the women were told the available man was a millionaire, when instead he was just an average Joe. So the show was a huge success in the first season when Zora decided to date Evan despite his paycheck. The two walked away with a million dollars and then ended up splitting money when they split up as a couple. Season two was kind of a dud though, so the show went away until this coming January when it's coming back to Fox with a twist. Joe Millionaire for Richer or Poorer will debut in the new year with two available men. One is rich, one is poor, and the women won't know who is who. I think we'll have to play a lot once it premieres. And Ryan Reynolds in the news tonight, definitely a millionaire. Uh, he announced a sabbatical from acting. He recently wrapped filming an Apple TV Plus musical called Spirited with Will Ferrell and Octavia Spencer and said it was the perfect time for a little sabbatical from making movies. Uh, telling The Hollywood Reporter he's trying to create a little more space for his family, his wife Blake Lively and their three daughters, James, Inez, and Betty. We are expecting Spirited to debut on Apple TV Plus this holiday season. And one more movie story for you tonight. What celeb do you think would make a good real life evil queen? Did Gal Gadot come to mind? She's currently in talks to join the team behind the live action version of Snow White, where Rachel Zelger will play the princess. The movie will feature original music from the creators of Dear Evan Hansen. Sounds pretty good. We've always got more Insta Chat for you inside our Instagram story, A Good Day Stateline, including why Tom Hanks didn't want to join Jeff Bezos in space. Go find out. We'll be right back with the team from Prairie Fire.